Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Sabun. I'm back with another reaction. In today's video, we'll be reacting to a video of the Min Indonesian military um, and their training of survival in the jungle. So stay tuned. We're going to get into that video in just a couple of minutes. For those of you who are new, I upload videos daily. So take a moment to subscribe to the channel and turn notification on so you're notified when a new video is uploaded. Stay tuned, guys. We'll be right back. Thank you very much for coming back. Let's get into the video. During the training, I cannot stress more on the safety. <laughs> so it's the Indonesian army in conjunction with the American army they're training their uh, uh, survival uh, way of surviving I guess basically in the jungle The American uniform, subhanAllah, it blends in more with the, its surrounding in comparison to the Indonesian one. The Indonesian one is more darker green, darker brown, it stands out, where the American one, it just blends in with the background. Are you ambushing or tracking? So it looks like they got uh, snipers as well as machine guns that they're practicing to shoot. And here you can see what I was mentioning. You see the Indonesian uniform, it's more darker. The American one, you can see the background just they blend in. It kind of turns them into camouflage. But the Indonesian one stands out a little bit more. inside the room doesn't know you're coming. Now he's looking into that corner. Then he comes across and goes to the corner he wasn't looking at. So it looks like they're just basically to some extent just kind of like teaching or showing uh, the Indonesian army how to do certain things like if they're going into a house if there's four of them which area each of them should be looking at for example. So, yang bahaya adalah udara masuk. Karena udara yang masuk dari luar itu So they had actually a map that's showing like uh, strategies of how to maneuver, I guess, attack and whatnot. And here, they're uh, teaching them how to, I guess, help a um, hurt or somebody's wounded, like a soldier in the battlefield. <laughs> Dalam patroli ada jebakan. Hati-hati dalam merasakan patroli, terutama. Okay. 
That's crazy. They actually put like branches of trees and bushes on themselves. So it makes them camouflage more and they have their faces painted. I wonder how they do that. Do they apply it themselves or like they help one another, for example, to put that face uh, painting on? I get the survival so the Indonesian uh, army is showing the American ones some of the native uh, food or vegetables that they're cutting through and sharing it with them. So it looks like they're now practicing patrol and I guess maybe here they might be setting up a tent or something. That's really really smart. They have basically two jacket of their uniform uh, closed and then put through those sticks and they're using that as a as a way of carrying like an injured soldier. So that's really unique I guess out in the battlefield if you don't have anything you just find two sticks you take out your jacket and you get one more and now you can carry a, an injured soldier. I think that was like an aloe vera plant that they were trying to cut because I think you can you can eat it and it has a lot of water in it. Hey USMC, come here. Yeah, USMC, come here. USMC. We have to tighten here and a range of the swing of the trees. Actually, this is uh, not too big trees. <laughs> Looks like now they're setting up a uh, trap. Not sure whether they're setting up trap for humans or they're set, uh, setting up trap for animals so they can eat it, for example, as a way of food. Then we put some branches or bait inside there. Actually, we made this uh, animal strap on the track, not on the side like. Okay, because it's, it was so small, I think it's most likely to trap animals. Of the trap. Actually, we set up different kind of spinach on the small river. Thorn and not. Basically, just survival training. So, if you're stuck in the jungle, how you can find your food, how you can trap animals, what vegetation or fruits you can eat, which you should avoid. Mm -hmm. A beef, but we 
eat Laos <laughs> wrong food. But this is just for listening. Yeah, same but different. See the roach? to show you the different kind of plants because one has a bigger root and I think that's the root is what you can eat as a source of food So here is another uh, trap, I guess, for another small animal, and I'm just curious what's going to happen with that snake. <laughs> that's awesome they're actually making rice inside the bamboo so this is perfect for survival because you, you never know you ever get stuck in a jungle especially for soldiers at least you know some way of surviving for a couple of days until you get some help right <laughs> So they have two way of making uh, rice. One was in the bamboo, and now this is inside another piece of wood, which is pretty unique. Rice with uh, coconut. Oh, nice. Coconut. Sorry, sorry, sorry. No, you're good. Yeah, it's quite. It's a local dish. Uh, for cooking. This is the bamboo. So from what I heard, they said rice with coconut. I'm guessing they put rice inside the coconut and then they put the coconut in fire, which is another unique idea. And actually, first uh, cook, I'd like to show about the monitor lead shirt. Mm. And after that, we cut him. Cut him? We cut him. Yeah. yeah. I put inside first. Inside. 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 After this, uh, we show about the monitor lizard. <laughs> so now they're doing some kind of snake training. <laughs> Let's continue. With a poor thing. Can we catch the snake? <laughs> okay. right, Don't try to use that uh, neck. It's dangerous. Okay, so they didn't have the blood drinking within the picture that they have because I guess it wasn't part of this uh, video, but uh, pretty unique things. You know, that's awesome. They're teaching them certain things. It's nice to know because sometimes you get stuck somewhere, especially like I said, for soldiers, you have to have some way of surviving until you get help. I think even for people who do hiking, it's good to know some uh, survival, um, some, some way of surviving because you get stuck, bad weather comes in, people can't come to help you, you have to be able to survive for a day or two, finding your own food or at least staying warm. Um, so a really good video, thank you very much guys for suggesting it. If you'd like me to react to another video, please put in the comment section below. As always, if you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. I hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day. Take care of yourself and your family. And inshallah, I'll see you in the next video. Take care and wassalam.